Hi, my name is Danielle. I'm a classified staff member at Clark College, a WPA member, a shop steward, and also a member of the bargaining team for the higher education table. This year has been such a whirlwind and I'm so grateful for all the connections that I've gotten to build this year, getting involved in what we call the Contract Bargaining Action Team, or CBAT. On August 24th, I sent out a request for WPA members to get involved with a letter writing campaign run by another union. I wanted to make sure that I understood the steps, so I filled out the form myself and passed along a message to my legislators. On August 31st, I received a response from my state representative, and I wanna share some of that with you today. In response to a public employee asking that the budget not be balanced on the backs of working people, my state representative said, I believe the prudent way to close this budget gap is for government to tighten its belt, make the difficult decisions, prioritize what programs need to be kept intact, which can be slimmed back, and which may need to be eliminated temporarily or permanently. It's no different than living on a household budget. After talking to members, after hearing their stories, after listening to their concerns and sharing my own about what's at stake for us, I find it appalling that the response was to suggest that the situation with the state budget is no different than living on a household budget. This is not the same at all. And I want to make sure that we have that conversation. Send us your stories. The email is video at wpea.org. CBED has already received several video submissions, and I'm so excited to share them with you in the days and weeks to come. Please consider lending your voice. Please consider joining the movement, getting involved, reaching out to your lawmakers, making your voice heard. We're stronger together, always.